Hello everyone, it's Pai Guru this side and today in this tutorial we are going to learn how can we intercept and modify request using HTTP debugger code. So for this we will try to uh, increase the score in one of the games available on telegram uh, without using burp suite. Okay. So in one of the previous tutorials we do is burp suite modify the score value here we will be directly interacting with the telegram. So for this I have already opened uh, HTTP Debugger Pro, we already have tutorials on how to use this, how to set up the Pro version. Okay, so you can see I already have intercepted a bunch of requests. Whenever you open HTTP Debugger Pro, it by default uh, start intercepting every request that occurs on the system. So as you can see, it is intercepting request from uh, there is an application called Fluvius, and then uh, search host. This is something then Telegram.exe. Chrome.exe. You can see these are the applications, and it's intercepting all the requests from these applications. As well as Firefox and System Request Index. You see Work.exe and Task Force W.exe. Okay, so uh, HTTP Debugger Pro by default intercept all kind of requests. What we want is what we want to intercept a uh, request from Telegram. So for this, uh, what I'll do, I'll simply open a game. Uh, you can search this game like this. Go to search bar and type game bot. Okay, so you will get this game. Go here and click on start. Or you can just type slash start. It will start a game mode for you. Then click on play with friends and just forward it to any group. Uh, I'm just simply forward it to my own group, personal group. And you can select one of the games, uh, three games available. So I'm just going to select this number exact here. Okay, now when I click on play number Z, it will open the game directly in Telegram. Okay, so you can see this is the game here. And if I open HTTP Debugger Pro, you will see uh, it will start intercepting request from this also. But here the uh, game is not directly available uh, as Telegram.exe, but it will be under MS as Web V. Okay, so Telegram is this MS as Microsoft is browser to open games for you so what i'll do i'll simply try to play this game okay so let's try to play and let's say i have scored 10 here and what i want is i want to increase the score here okay let's say you are not able to manually score more than this so we'll try to just uh, increase the score by uh, using test equity developer here so first of all we have to find the request which is increasing the score here so as you can see there are a bunch of requests here and we are not able to find the correct thing. Uh, but we know that this game is uh, from MS Web Edge uh, web view. Uh, so what we can do, we can just filter the application based on the application. Uh, simply uh, click on this application filter link, uh, click on select link and then select only those applications that you want to intercept. So let's say uh, I want to intercept MS Edge web view. And then I'll try to, uh, let's say, telegram.exe as well. Okay, so we are intercepting two requests here. Again, you can see, uh, still we are able to get uh, like this. Okay, so, but again, it's intercepting all kinds of things like audio, image, everything. What we want is we want to filter, let's say, only the JSON. Okay, we know that uh, we, what, uh, we have to intercept only JSON payload. So we'll simply click on this type filter and then click on select application slash this okay. now we are good to go and as you filter it you will see uh, API request is being made here tbot.xyz slash API slash set score okay so let's click on this and you can see the application here is ms edge web view 2.exe and this is basically scoring uh, setting the score for this game so you can see if this is the header this is the content okay so now this content may look like that it's something uh, we are unable to understand, but basically this is uh, base 64 encoded string. If you want to understand it, you can just copy this part and open your Chrome browser and here you can type uh, base 64 decode.org. This is a website. And here you can just paste this uh, string and you can just click on decode. It will show something okay, like this. This will try to encode, uh, encode it back. 
but again uh, this contains my username and desktop data which i don't know what it is what we want is we want to increase the score so what is i'll again click on this uh, api call and then right click on it and then click on edit and resubmit okay so when you click on edit and resubmit a new uh, pop up window will appear like this what we have to do we have to click on the content and here you can see uh, this ey part as we know is a base 64 code string and there is a and score parameter which contains the score 10 okay since i am score 10 here let's say i want to increase it to 15 or 20 or anything uh let's say if you're playing in a group and you want to score the highest what you can do you can just type 100 okay. and after clicking on 100 just click on submit and it says since uh, finished receiving response so uh, if now uh, i just open it you will see nothing happens here but if i close it and you can see i, I go back to telegram my score has already been increased to 100 so this is how you can use http debugger pro to intercept and modify values within any of the applications that you are using okay for more advanced schemes like the new reward we have already a tutorial on how to intercept that and increase score because they use as values which we have to modify okay so this is it for this video guys if you love this video leave a like or a dislike also this video is a part of my uh this youtube course if you want to uh, support me you can just purchase this course and help me motivate me to create more videos on ethical hacking thank you see you in the next tutorial